Hey guys, welcome back to VL InfoTech. Today in this video, we will see how to write a Python program to print product of each digits of a given number. For example, if the given number is 34676, six, now we need the output in this format like 3 into 4 into 6 into 7 into 6. Now the product of each digits combining each digits is 3024. Like this we need to get the output. Now let's get started. First we will write the code, later on we will see the code. I am doing all these python programming tutorials to help the beginners to learn python easily. So please support me. Please subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon so that you will never miss an update. And also while learning python if you have any question in any program please comment down the question so that we can communicate and we can make solutions for that code. These programs are at very basic level. By learning basic level only, we can get more and more advanced level we can learn. Yeah, we are done with the code. Now we need to file. We need to save the file. Click on file. Click on save as. Now we need to enter file name. Any name you can enter. File name dot with the extension py. Now we need to save the python file with the extension .py. So file name .py enter. Yeah, file is saved. Now we need to execute this program by using command prompt. To open command prompt, click here. Type cmd to open command prompt. Now give path cd space desktop enter dictionary enter now you have to provide file name with extension dot py enter now we need to enter a number any number now here i am entering 5643 enter see we are getting 360 means 5 into 6 into 4 into 3 that is 360 once again we will see Enter. See, we are getting 12. In this way, we can find the product of each digit, product of all digits of a given number. Copy paste the output. Yeah, this is the code and this is the output. Now we will see the code line by line. N equal to in int input enter a number this line of code is used to enter a number by the user and product equal to 1 always initial value of the product should be 1 because if we take 0 as initial value 0 into anything is 0 that's why product should be 1 always while n not equal to 0 if the condition is true then it will enter the loop now product equal to product into n modulus 10 modulus operator will give remainder of the number so n modulus 10 it will give remainder of the number and next n this is a floor division n floor division 10 it will give coefficient of the number then it will print product 
this is the output and in this way we can get the product of all digits of a given number that's it for today's video if you have any questions regarding the code please comment down below that's it for today's video i will see you in the next video until then keep coding keep smiling if you like this video please like share and subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon so that you will never miss an update